Mike Benkowski, our pal from Poland, coming in with this. We're doing a little grip ink. Uh, and, and I'm pretty sure this is that Dave Lombardo band, and I want to say it was like right out of, I remember him starting Grip Inc. right out of uh, when he left Slayer that first time, but uh, we're doing this for Mike, uh, and we're doing the song Hostage to Heaven, which is the number two on their uh, top five here. What we do is we learn about Grip Inc., and then we listen to the song Hostage to Heaven uh, right here together for the first time, or maybe you've heard it before. Sound fun? Let's go then. Grip Inc. They got 26,058 monthly listeners to the Spotify account. Top five jams. Now I'm seeing two album covers here, so this is kind of telling me maybe they put out two albums or three albums or something like that. But in the first slot, you got Rusty Nail, 369,000 plays. In the second slot, the song we are doing here today, Hostage to Heaven, 534,000 plays. Ostracized, uh, from this record as well, 316,000 plays. You got Pathetic Liar, 409,000 plays. You got Portrait of Henry. Isn't that fun? Portrait of Henry, 84,000 plays. The album this uh, song comes from is called Power of Inner Strength. And maybe he, you know, was thinking that. He's like, you know what, Dave? There's some power of inner strength that needs to happen here with Grip Inc., since Slayer are damn jerks to me. Uh, let's look into the albums here. You got 1995's Power of Inner Strength. Then you got Nemesis, 1997. You got Solidify, 1999. And Incorporated, 2004. So they released four records. I didn't know that. I, I, uh, I, I knew of it. I may have heard a song or two, but uh, nothing that I could ever remember. Uh, now we're going to look into those related artists. This will take us down a rabbit hole of other bands to check out. Perhaps Grip, Grip Inc. played shows with these bands. Perhaps they toured with these bands. Perhaps uh, if uh, Grip Inc. is on playlists, they're with these bands. And I bet Slayer will be listed, probably. You got Flotsam and Jetsam, Wonderful, Overkill, Prong, Forbidden, X Hoarder, Heathen, Death Angel, Sacred Reich, Coroner, Wonderful, Sanctuary, um, Dark Angel and Violence. A lot of thrashy bands there, huh? They, they're keeping the thrash style. Uh, let's get into that bio ever so quickly, and then we're going to get into the song. And you got four gents here. It's a black and white photo. They says, let's get down on our scrunchies. One guy says, I'm going to kick my legs out, and I'm going to kind of relax, but you guys get down on your scrunchies there. This guy's going to take a po photo of us in the industrial factory area while we're on our break. And then I come over and say, guys, you want to play a good game of hacky sack before you get back to work? And they say, kiss my ass. Ex-Slayer drummer Dave Lombardo put Grip Inc. together in the mid-90s after leaving one of metal's most successful acts in order to better manage his personal life and expand his creative possibilities. Lombardo was idolized by fans and musicians in awe of the power, speed, and control he exhibited on the drum kit while with Slayer and the more dynamic but still quite heavy music of Grip Inc. only enhanced the drummer's reputation as a true metal virtuoso. There you have that. So this, this is going to be some stuff for the old Binkowski man, okay? This is the Magic Teddy Pies. We know, we know. This is the Magic Teddy Tool. I give you a taste, I take a taste. We listen to Hostage to Heaven right here, right now. Let's do it. I like that. That's good, it's tasty. Check I sing it. I like his voice. I like the way he sings. Oh yeah. Nice, David. Nice.
He's laying it down. He's saying, how you like me now, Slayer? How you, how you like me now? I'd like to know all the guys that are in this band. That's a great... Hostage to heaven. Very tight, very crunchy, very... Wow, this is definitely different. Out of the box, you know? Wasn't expecting something like this. We get Tom Araya to come in and go. Wow. That was a very interesting interlude. I like it. Sometimes I'll let my solos get away from me. That is such a great, what, pre-chorus? Yeah, I love it. I like it. Stop it on a dime. You know they're gonna stop this on a dime. Thought it was gonna be a little trickier than that, but uh, okay. That's fine. Dave, it's fine, okay? Ostracized. You know, I am gonna go listen to this whole record because I do not believe that I was ever, didn't, I didn't realize it was gonna be that good. I, I really like that. I think the vocals were great. The mix and, and, and all that was sounded good. The guitar sounded great. Of course, they're gonna put those drums up higher, right? Gotta put, hey, it's the Dave Lombardo band. He's gonna have some, the drums are just gonna sit on top. Okay, what say you? Most important part of my videos, as always and will always ever be, and I've said this uh, many, many times, is um, my favorite part's where you get in the comments below and tell me exactly what you think of Grip Inc., Hostage to Heaven, all the goodies, goodies, and num num yuggets that you can give me. Good, great, fantastic chain. I'm a massive fan of Grip Inc. In fact, they're my all-time favorite band. I like them better than Slayer. You do? Tell me why. Were you ever lucky enough to see Grip Inc. live? I want to say that I missed a show that they played in like some radio station or some kind of promoter was doing it for free as well. Uh, but uh, all-time favorite album, all-time favorite songs from Grip Inc. Other stuff we should check out, official videos and such. Have you ever met Dave Lombardo? Um, are you a huge fan of Grip Inc. over Slayer? I'd be curious into hearing uh, from folks like that. Or you could say, not good, not great. Shane? He, if he's not in Slayer, he's not in anything. He can be a Mr. Bunkle and Slayer, but he can't be in anything else. I don't like this. Not my cup of tea. Don't want it. Don't need it. Never going to listen to it again. All of that can be put in the comments below, don't you know? If you have a hard rock or a heavy metal special request, you'd like to see it on this channel, you can do that. Hit one of them links in the description below. You can join the Patreon, put in a one-time request, or you can put it in the comments. If you put it in the comments, I see it, like it, we haven't done it, hit it with a heart, tell you I'm going to do your request. At some point in the near future, you will see it on the channel. Okay? Swing it out. Uh, Grip Inc. <laughs>